Shuttleworth Collection Heritage Day is an annual celebration of the whole collection and the rich history that Old Warden has created. The flying display typically focuses on the collection aircraft, with a selection of visiting aircraft, often with an Old Warden connection. On the ground there was an opportunity to get up close to the display aircraft with an uncovered paddock, offering the chance to examine the aeroplanes and vehicles in detail ahead of the flying display in the afternoon. The display itself started with a high energy performance from the Global Stars aerobatic team, who performed a three-ship aerobatic display in close formation. The collection's latest addition, the Miles Hawk Speed 6, made its first appearance alongside the collection's other iconic racer, the DH-88 Comet. It was a unique sight to see these two historic racers in the air together. Another unique visiting display came from the Fokker Wolf FW44 Stiglitz, which showed off its impressive aerobatic performance as part of a unique display. The collection's training aircraft were out in force, with the Chipmunk and both old Warden-based Magisters. An unquestionable highlight of the show was the return of an old Warden resident from the past. Spitfire Mark 11 PL983 spent some time at Old Warden as an effective gate guardian decades ago, before eventually being restored to fly. The aircraft recently returned to the skies again following a lengthy restoration with the Aircraft Restoration Company at Duxford. This show is the first return to Old Warden for the aircraft since its return to flight. Amazingly, this show also saw Peter Teichmann's Mark 11 Spitfire, PL965, join 983 in the air. This will most certainly have been one of the few times that two Mark 11s have performed together in the air. The old Warden-based Warbirds also delivered polished performances, with flights from the Gladiator, Spitfire, and the Hawker Hurricane pair. Luckily, weather conditions allowed for some of the World War I aircraft to take to the skies, including a close formation pairing of the Sopwith Triplane and Sopwith Camel. Fittingly, given the theme of the day, three of Richard Shuttleworth's aeroplanes flew together. The Compass Swift, the Suter, and DH-60 Moth flew a short formation display before performing individually. Closing the show was a fitting Shuttleworth finale, the Edwardians. It was left to the Bristol Boxkite and Avro triplane to bring things to a close on this occasion. The Heritage Day was a brilliant reminder of everything that is so unique about Old Warden. There really is nothing like a Shuttleworth air show.